From the Modelo Studios in Lubbock, Texas, this is Campus Live. What's up, Red Raiders? Welcome to another edition of Campus Live TV. I'm Eve Woodward. We took a trip to our favorite movie spot, Premier Cinema, to see Spiral from the Book of Saw. See what we had to say. What's up, fans? We're live at Premier Cinemas and IMAX. We were about to see Spiral, so we want to get everyone's input on see what they're expecting and what they want to get out of the movie. So we're going to start with Adrian. Um, okay, so I have seen the trailer, and I know it has like Chris Rock and Samuel L. Jackson in it. And it's kind of hard to take both of them serious, um, you know, because of their previous roles. But I think they're taking a more serious role on this one, and I'm really excited to see how they do it. I, I have a feeling they're going to kill it, and it's, it's going to be awesome. I've seen the trailer, I've seen the other Saw movies, so I'm really curious to see how it's going to continue. I'm not a huge fan of thriller movies, but for some reason the Saw series like totally captivated my attention. I don't know if it has to do with the gore, the graphic scenes, or like the twists and turns, but um, I really want to see if they keep that momentum throughout this new chapter. But also, or if they're trying to go into a different direction, because I know they have actors such as Chris Rock, and he's very, you know, he's known for being a comedian. So I want to know if he's going to be used as somewhat as a comic relief, or if um, he's going to like try to change his aesthetic from being a comedian to more serious. So we guess we'll just have to see and find out. Definitely, and kind of falling onto what Michelle said, Chris Rock is a great actor, more known for a comedian, but really haven't seen him in anything. And on the other side of things, Samuel Jackson, you just can't go wrong. Personally, <laughs> I haven't seen the trailer. But um, on the music side of things, 21 Savage actually released a song for it called Spiral. So a lot going into the movie, a lot of big names. Uh, just have to see how it turns out. All right, well, that's it. We're about to head into the movie. We're going to grab some popcorn, drinks, and a few hot dogs. So follow us. from watching the Spiral movie, so we want to get everyone's thoughts and see what they thought about it. So Adrian, how'd you feel about it? Um, I liked it a lot. I'm usually a person who can like predict like the ending or be like, I bet you it was this guy, but they totally like just messed my mind up with, you know, with the final, final scenes of the movie. So it was, it was really good. Um, definitely gory. But I mean, it could have been, you know, way more gory, way more blood. I thought it was good. To me, it was a little predictable, but maybe that's because I've seen all of the Saw movies. So I kind of had a little bit of an idea of what to look for. It, there wasn't as much gore as Saw movies typically have, but it was still good. Yeah, I have to go off on Allison has to say, because yeah. I mean, it's just a little predictable to me because of the same bit. thing, just watching them, you know what to pick out, like, oh, yeah. this, like, this sounds interesting. Mm -hmm. You gotta put the pieces together throughout the movie. Yeah. And yeah, it was very predictable for me, at least, I guess for us. Everyone else, I guess, thought yeah. it was really good. Mm -hmm. I think it should have had a little more gore to it, because Saw's very, like, you know, the staple of all that yeah. blood. Typically, they have and, a little bit more gore. Yes, yeah, yeah, so I mean, they definitely shifted more to the serious scenes, you know, spinning it to different, you know, you know, environments besides like, you know, the original Saw's dungeon, basically. So. Um, yeah, there's a lot happening in the movie. Kind of going off what Adrian said, this wasn't, you know, Grown Ups 1 or 2 where he's, you know, being the funny guy. He's intense, serious, the, and from mm -hmm. the very first scene to the absolute end of the movie is an intense movie. It definitely had me on the edge of my seat. Good, good. Okay, so what would you guys overall rate it? What do you think? I give it a, uh, I give it a, an eight out of um, ten. I'm sorry. And... <laughs> I'd give it a seven. Okay, so yeah, yeah, I'll give it like a six or a seven. Six or a seven. Uh, I'd give it a seven to a strong seven point five. Strong seven point five. Yeah. Right. Special thanks to Premier Cinema and IMAX for letting us come by to do a movie review. And make sure you tune in next month in June for our next movie review. And as always, come check out the great food, drinks, and atmosphere here at Premier Cinema and IMAX. Until next time, welcome. That's it for this episode of Campus Live TV. If you have any movie suggestions, let us know in the comments below. And as always, 
Don't forget to follow at Campus Live TTU for all things Lubbock and Texas Tech. And until next time on Campus Live TV, I'm Eve Woodward.